I've been living in Los Angeles for 10 years and I used to love this place and call it home. I met a lot of amazing people here, including my husband. I made good memories, became a filmmaker, and was first initiated on my healing journey. Now with my new set of eyes, so to speak, I can see the superficiality of this place. I feel the low vibrational energies that come from the totalitarianism and technocracy we experience here today. They're like vampires that suck on our vital energies day after day. I feel misplaced. The Lemurian energy here in California is so strong. The continent of Lemuria, which once covered what is now the Pacific Ocean, was organized into a very advanced society. A civilization where people enjoyed peace of mind and understood and lived by the divine laws. enabling them to build the most magnificent civilization the world has ever known. Lemuria is considered the ancestral home of mankind, an entire ancient continent that sank to the bottom of the ocean due to negligent use of technology and abuse of power. The similarities between Lemuria and California are undeniable. Today it became more obvious that we wanted to leave, but we didn't know where to go or even how to start the moving process. Ready? Yes. For the past three years, Antonio and I try our best to make this place better than we first found it. 7.45. So 7.45 and we're still working on our pretty garden. We build our oasis, commune and learn from Mother Earth and have really beautiful moments in this place. The decision to sell the house was not easy. It was the first property we owned together. We had so many dreams and wishes. But it takes a village to make things better. We sold our car. We sold our home. It's a big leap of faith. And all we know is that we have a place to stay for the next two weeks. We feel sad, anxious about the unknown, but also excited for what's to come. It's definitely a bittersweet feeling.
Our ancestors have always chosen to start their villages by a river or any other source of water. Having lived for so long in the desert made me realize how disconnected I was from simple principles. Growing our own food and storing water is no longer a hobby, but a necessity. It took us 22 days from the day we accepted an offer in our LA home to entering our new house. It feels like leaving LA was more like an evacuation plan. Ever since we landed here, everything fell into place better than if we had planned. In one week, we got a car, we found a house. Everyone here is so nice and kind and welcomed us with open arms. The only hiccup we had was that we were expecting our move to arrive on December 1st, the day we moved into the new house, but it only arrived a week later. So we were literally camped at the new house for a few days. I'm so happy and proud of what we've done. We follow our hearts and never let the outside noise interfere with our choices. We chose Florida for its natural beauties, for the possibility of being more self-sufficient, for the freedom of making our own choices, and for the integrity of its fundamental values that cherish and protect all life forms. even before they're born into this physical reality. These are some of the values that we like to pass on to our little angel.